The usual huge French crowds greeted the drivers for the first of the qualifying session, and it was heart in the mouth stuff for Johan Christofferson at Turn 1. A textbook launch from P3, but tagged by Kevin Abering. He hung on for dear life, and once the panic was over, though, it was plain sailing all the way to the line. Just behind, Kevin Abering showed it can pass at Loiac with a last corner lunge past Enzo Ide. Huge setup changes between practice and qualifying did the trick for Niklas Kronholm. He made the most of pole position, led from start to finish, and posted the fastest time of Q1. Could this be the turning point for the Finn? The elbows were out from the very off in Q2. Kevin Abering muscled his way to the front, leaving Timo Scheider and Enzo Ide to fight it out behind. Their rough housing eased the pressure on the Dutchman. Scheider kept him honest, and Abering posted a very fast time. Race two saw Christian Zabo put the squeeze on the Hansons. That left them playing catch-up while out front, the rejuvenated Gronholm led Christofferson. The champion opted for the early joker, then got the hammer down, and come the merge had done enough to beat Gronholm and Kevin Abering's time. Defending world champion Johan Christofferson tops the table at the halfway point of the qualifying rounds. Niklas Gronholm is in second spot, Abering third, and a surprise for many, the Hansons are in fourth and fifth position with two sessions still to go.